Hey guys, Cube Hamster here with a new science video and I have not done one of these in ages but uh, yeah, what I'm about to show you has real Minecraft applications so uh, yeah, stay tuned. Um, I want to talk about the De Bruyne sequence which is a uh, yeah something a Dutch mathematician came up with. Basically it's a sequence of ones and zeros, the ones being the solid blocks and the zeros being the glass block. Um, which contains uh, the same amount of binary numbers that it has ones and zeros. So um, I've got a feed tape here looped around and as you can see the output is now one 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 and I hope you guys are familiar with binary but each time I press the button I get a different binary output so now it's one uh, zero one 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 and each press gives a different output. Oh, I pressed a bit too fast and if I spin this really fast now, um, basically 16 blocks, 16 different outputs and if you hook this up to a decoder you can then decode one feed tape into 16 different states which is basically what I did with my uh, rotating combination lock, the combination lock that had over 33 million different combinations and uh, was very compact and I also used something similar to this in my rollable dice to get the yeah, binary output for the six different dice rolls. Um, there's a bunch of these sequences, this is the one with uh, 16 binary numbers but you could have uh, uh, 32 as well, um, it sort of depends on how many numbers you want to tap off um, because it's basically the amount of um, stuff you tap off, it's 2 to the power of what you tap off, that's the amount of different uh, binary numbers there is. So I'm tapping off 4 things now, four, uh, yeah, 4 numbers, so I get 16 different combos and I hope you see that if I, I try to basically show that each uh, segment of 4 blocks is different um, and it's looped around, so as you can see when we go down here and we reach 0, 1, 1, 0 it basically loops to the other side, so then I've got 1, 0, 1, 1 and 0, 1, 1, 1 and I hope you guys see that n nowhere in the sequence is uh, yeah, the same combination of uh, glass and uh, solid blocks this thing is very useful, in the description I will also add uh, the sequence for uh, 32 different binary numbers so that then in that case you're tapping off 5 different blocks uh, which you could hook up to a feed tape uh, and get a lot of different states uh, I can also show you the one for uh, 8 different states states, which, which is 111000110 um, so in this case you're, you're tapping off uh, uh, three blocks and you should let's see oh, get uh, all these different states and then the last one there we go so that's the eight different states for that one now silly being as it is there's also one for four which is not maybe not that useful and if you want one with two states that's the the brown sequence for uh, two states then you're tapping off one um, so very nice um, yeah you can basically use this to uh, uh, make selectors and stuff like I did or to get your outcome to uh, if you if you have something hooked up to uh, yeah, a lot of feed tapes and you want to know what state the feed tape is on then this is the way to go um, so basically just have a tape here, you can, I mean I hooked it up like this this feed tape is actually quite fast, it's as fast as you can get a feed tape to go and uh, yeah, you stop it and it instantly stops and you get your binary output so very useful stuff um, Yeah. I hope you guys like this and I hope you guys can find some interesting uses for this. Um, you will probably see me using this again in the future. It's a very compact way of getting lots of different binary outputs and uh, yeah, just hook it up to a decoder and uh, you're done basically. So guys, thanks for watching. Uh, if you're new to my channel, be sure to subscribe, got cool stuff and uh, yeah, thanks for watching. I will see you all later. Bye bye.